My name is Jay Melby. I am a service experience owner. I use WalkMe in several ways. Probably the most important way that we deploy it on a, on a week to week basis is as new features are being developed, we're able to target individual users and, and pilot test it and track their adoption of it, see what's working, what's, what's not working. And then as we do a mass deployment to thousands of users, in the past, we would have job aids, we would have emails that would go out, we'd have all sorts of static stuff that worked for some people, but most people, it just didn't work for it. And WalkMe is able to come in and using in-app guidance, we're able to explain what the feature is, here's how you can use it and track their actual adoption of it. And so that end-to-end -end change management from building the awareness to teaching them to reinforcement, WalkMe kind of fits into that work stream really well and makes it much easier for both us and our end users as we roll out platform features. Uh, one of the features that we worked on developing was the ability to refer clients to a specialized team to help educate them on some of our more advanced platforms and capabilities. It was fairly complex and multi-step process and it involved a number of steps that had to be filled out correctly. So we used several capabilities of WalkMe to make this happen and ensure we had a successful rollout. Everything from the messaging and smart walkthrough through custom smart tips and the ability to ensure that as they're going through this form, anything that could be automated, we would automatically click and make it really simple. And for those users who still were having troubles, we could identify when they would fall out of it and target them with specialized messaging and a smart walkthrough to ensure that they felt comfortable submitting this, what looked to be complex, but really was easy because WalkMe enabled us to automate so much of it. All of those ripples were, were eliminated. We had smooth water because of WalkMe and it was a successful deployment. WalkMe fits into our change management strategy. It's, it, it's nestled in several areas from an initial training and onboarding the first few weeks that employees come in. And then as part of new product feature enhancements and, and rollouts, it, it fits in with other traditional forms of messaging, communication, team huddles, things like that. Uh, but it really reinforces and oftentimes is the complete bolstering agent to ensure that we tell managers this is coming and you're going to learn about it through WalkMe. Because we've just found that emails, they don't get read. Or if they do get read, they don't get disseminated out. Whereas with WalkMe, we can target at specific moments to a specific audience. Here's this feature that's coming or this feature that just launched. And we can reinforce if you're not using the feature or if you dismiss the message, we know that we can target it some more. And so throughout that whole chain of, of, of change management, we're able to leverage WalkMe and ensure we have much higher rates of adoption and usage. Getting high adoption and ensuring that our, our platform is being used in the right way and features are developed, it, it's important because oftentimes these features are a direct result of user feedback. And when users aren't aware of it, they think their feedback is just going into a black hole. Uh, and, and that directly impacts employee engagement. If they ask for something and then they see that it's delivered and it makes their life a little bit easier, uh, we, we find that that results in much higher levels of engagement. It's this huge aha moment. And every time someone who hasn't seen it before sees it, they just love it and, and they ask for more. We can also directly measure the results of that from reduced time to successful completion. The other one is the ability to track engaged elements and what are users clicking because in many platforms, the analytics just really aren't there and we're able to use WalkMe in that way. So when we develop these features, we can track the usage of it and we're able to tie that back to our business value drivers, which prior to WalkMe, we, we really didn't have that ability at all. When we first rolled out an update to our CRM to, to thousands of users, we were not getting the adoption that we wanted and we really couldn't figure out why we were doing user experience studies, we were doing surveys, and, and we we just couldn't quite figure out why we weren't getting the adoption. Uh, but using a combination of analytics from WalkMe, uh, surveys within WalkMe, targeting segmentation, and, and kind of determining who is using some of these features, we get them back into the reasons why the rest of our audience was not. And we're able to make some product updates, what in, looking backwards was kind of minor modifications and tweaks, we were able to really turn that adoption around and build on that success. The WalkMe team is, is really awesome. Don't be afraid to bring up any challenges, questions, issues, concerns. We have a fantastic relationship with them and couldn't speak more highly of them.